Hey everybody, Aaron Bonner again here. So, back in the day, I began a Minecraft Let's Play. And unfortunately, due to hard drive issues and that sort of thing, I actually have no idea where that file went. Um, it's something that I, I wanted to continue, but I, I honestly have absolutely no idea where my game save is. So, I figured it's time for a reboot, um, especially with as far as Minecraft has come uh, in the past... Oh, loading chunks here. Um, in the past year and a half or so... Oh, hello, kitty. Nope, not right now. Uh, the hazards of having pets, right? Um, especially in the past year or so, since I've actually done my uh, Minecraft Let's Play, it's just come so far. So this is actually a seed that, uh, I must confess, I found online, and I was just blown away by it. I'm trying to kind of hop to higher ground here to give a better view of it. All the chunks and stuff are still loading, but you actually spawn almost at the cloud layer, which is pretty cool. The, uh... Uh, the scenery here is absolutely outstanding. Uh, the topography is ridiculous. Um, if these clouds would clear... Oh, what's up, Creeper? How's it hanging over there, buddy? Um, if these clouds would clear, actually, we might... Uh, I think we're going to do this. We're going to turn off clouds, just because you can really appreciate the true scale of this map without the clouds. Um, the number of biomes is, is phenomenal, packed in this little area. It's a beautiful valley. Uh, all the waterfalls falling down there. It's really pretty neat, so I think we'll uh, we'll start here, and um, yeah, that's that's what we'll do. Like I said, I figured it's time for a, uh, a Minecraft reboot. Um, it, it's been a long time since I played the PC version, if I'm honest. I've spent a lot of time on the Xbox version lately. Uh, it's definitely come leaps and bounds since it, it first came out, which is something that I discussed a while ago. Is that it, it was weird for me initially going back and forth between the two because I. I've actually played the PC version uh, since it was in beta. Uh, excuse me. Uh, yeah, no, beta. Um, I actually I purchased Minecraft the day it went beta. That's when I first heard about it. So I uh, I, I was it was kind of neat to see Minecraft develop. Uh, I guess so so far is what I'm trying to say. On um, the PC version and the Xbox version came out, and don't get me wrong, it's it's phenomenal. But I um, it was I don't know almost like a, a trip to the past. Uh, it was a little bit weird to get used to because the, the, the PC version, there were so many more features. Um, the, the content was, in my opinion, so much more developed. Hi, other creeper. And it, it was just kind of weird to, to jump back and forth between the two, but now the Xbox version uh, has come so far as well, which I think is awesome. Um, props to uh, the studios that are continuing to, de continuing to develop that. Boy, if I could talk here. Oh, man, you can tell my chunks are loading. This is awful here. So... Uh, Man, there's just creepers everywhere. There's another one right there. I am uh, playing on normal, and we are uh, starting a fresh survival world here. There's going to be no cheating or anything. I will try to do everything on camera. If it's something absolutely repetitive and boring, I'll just do a quick cut. Uh, but I assure you that I won't be won't be cheating, won't be doing anything like that. I do have another version of this map in uh, creative mode, which... I'm uh, I'm having just a ball with. It's so much fun. I mean, you can imagine the potential for all of these things. I can't help but look around and just... Uh, chunks loading again. I can't help but look around and, you know, imagine this phenomenal city uh, just hanging out. So I do have another version of this in creative mode. Um, but So that, that's where I'll do all my, my toying and tinkering. And um, maybe that will make an appearance. Who knows? Now I'm absolutely no idea how I got up here to try to navigate my way back down. Probably, however, yeah, see, look at that. Brand new achievements. Uh, probably make a pickaxe and gather some uh, some coal so we can survive our first night here, huh? That's probably the best thing to do. Uh, I guess we'll make a couple sticks. Yeah, there you go. That's good for now. I do see some coal hanging out down here as well as a creeper, which worries me slightly. Oh, there's some coal right there. Wait. Let's plop down our crafting table. We'll make a super quick, fast and dirty wood pick. Alrighty. Go to town here. Dig through the dirt with some seeds, because that's totally how it works, right? And then we need to find some, uh, some first night shelter here. Ha ha, check that out. Because I spent too long blobbing. Blobbing, blabbing. I was trying to say blab and... Blah blah. I don't even know. And now daylight's dwindling, and it's, it's uh, a scary world out there. The night is dark and full and ter full of terror. So we need to make some shelter. So we're gonna just chip away at the wall here. 
which, oh, wow, there's a lot more coal here than I expected. That's totally okay. That is all right. Oh, uh, let's see here. I think the only issue I'm really going to run into is that this map just begins so high natively. I mean, we're on uh, Y is 112, where C level Y is 64. And so I think it just it's the only challenge we're going to have is really finding a, a decent cave system or just the sheer effort of uh, digging down far enough to get some resources because coal occurs pretty commonly at just about every layer, but as far as iron and redstone, gold, of course, diamond, all the other fun goodies, lapis lazuli, and that sort of thing, they're going to be at uh, some further down levels. So I think that's going to be really our only challenge for now. I, oh, balls. Owie. Owie. Oh, oh, that was... Well, all right. The game's going to get real interesting real quick here. <laughs> uh, thank goodness some pork chops, pork chops fell from the sky. That is what we were after. Let's uh, hop into the sunlight here. We'll uh, we'll fell another tree or two maybe, and I think it's time to set up our shelter for the night already. Oh boy! Oh, well, we're off to uh, oh bugger! We're off to a great start. What also helps is that uh, for some reason oh god don't load chunks now no not right now not right now not right now. For some reason. Uh, my computer's having some audio issues temporarily here, so I can't hear anything. So if monsters are sneaking up on me, I'm not going to know it until they attack me. That Catching that spider was honestly... Oh, bugger. It's honestly just sheer luck. Get away from me. Oh, pick, pick, pick. Whew, boy. Because I am hurting. I'm going to nom raw pork chop. Nom, nom, nom. Really? I have to be at the full 10 bars to heal. God dang it. Okay, well, so, uh, already off the kind of a shitty start. It's my own fault, that was just my own stupidity. We'll mine this other, well, I say mine. We'll, uh, harvest this other tree. Really, I haven't gotten that. I hate how the achievements are kind of out of order like that. I, I, I should have gotten that already, but whatever. That's fine. It's all good. Well, there's a lot more wood in this tree than I anticipated. Well, actually, not that much more. Gather some dirt for a uh, fast and dirty shelter. We'll beat the crap out of Mr. Ouch, Mr. Cow here. Steal his uh, delicious steaks. Thank you, sir. Leather. Leather is always helpful for, for, bleh, for some uh, initial armor. Leap from tree to tree. I uh, can't make that jump. However, I can make this one. Actually, you know what would be cool is if I could uh, get enough bone meal... And just steal some saplings from here, and harvest the, uh, well, cut down the forest for how I like it, and then sort of custom grow a giant tree. I could just totally have a massive tree house in the middle of this that I live in. I really like that idea, actually. So we'll have to, uh, we'll make a, a fast and dirty shelter here for the night, and then, you know, gather resources, make some axes, go clear cut the forest, you know, as, as people tend to do. Um, that cave looks like a good little spot to hang out for the night, maybe. Let's see how much uh, chunks loading. Ah, see, how's that for some landscape? Holy moly, look at that. Jeez. Oh, man. The potential is just outrageous here. We're floating islands and mountains off that way. Uh, no idea where the sun is, so I suspect I only have about three minutes of daylight left, which means I have to make a shelter. I'm going to... Go down as far as I can here. Ouch. I'm probably going to go bludgeon these poor animals to death. Ooh, there's clay right here. Perfect. Uh, give me your meat. Nom, nom, nom. Oh, boy. If it would stop trying to just randomly load chunks on me, that would be phenomenal. Oh, frame rate. Atrocious. What is going on here? Oh my gosh. Well, this looks like as good a place as any. We'll uh, take some of this, this this here coal, as my pick is going to break in about one more block here. Yeah. Maybe it's going to last for longer than I expected. Hey, there we go. There it broke. We'll throw down another crafting table. We'll hide in the mountain for the night. Ooh, oh boy, bench making. Okay, great. Stone pick this time. Oh, yeah, moving up in the world, buddy. Getting an upgrade. Man, just achievements left and right here. Which actually, 
Oh, what? You can scroll now? Okay, that's cool. Uh, what all achievements do we have? Let's see. The furnace. On a rail. Hardware. Hot topic. Fish. Diamonds. Okay. Looks like a blaze rod and a ghast here. So I assume that's obsidian, which means we need to go to the nether. Just a regular old diamond. Diamond sword. Looks like an enchanting table. Possibly. Let's see. We have a hoe, a bread, and cake. Leather. Wheat. Uh, saddle. Okay, well, that's all, pretty much all the standard achievements. I added a couple more that I know of, anyway. Oh, yeah, this would be a good little base. There's a good good chunk of coal here. I think we're uh, a little bit closer to 64 now. Hey, check it out. We are at sea level. We are at 64. It's perfect. Make a little base here. We'll dig down a ways. It'll be uh, a nice distraction for the nighttime hours here, which are rapidly approaching. We'll dig this little area out, make it defensible. Might actually throw up a door. Eh, nah, I'm not going to put up a door on the first night here. Maybe night two or three, but not tonight. I don't think so. I don't even know if I'll stay here more than one night anyway. Break up the crafting table. Plop. Uh, dirt. Oh, more dirt. Haha, <laughs> I'm safe. Um... Turn this whole thing into shticks. Make a handful of torches. I'm sure make a full stack of 64 because, hey, why not? I'm actually in pretty good shape right now. Uh, we'll make a furnace. We can cook my meat so I can actually gain more health. Oh, man. Just achievement central over here. Uh, let me put up some torches so critters don't spawn on me here. Because that's just not good. Here she, oh, here she, have a, have a light. I'm going to go hide now because it's scary and dark. And, of course, I put my dirt away because that's apparently just how I roll. Okay, raw beef, coal, mm, cook steaks. Uh, let's see, five leather. What can I make with five leather? I can make a helmet. Oh, yeah, leather cap. I'll just, uh. Just throw that on. Mm. Oh man, stylish looks. Got the tuxedo rolling, leather hat, and nothing can stop me now. I'll open up my base a little bit further here. Yeah, we'll go three high. Why not? So while there's a brief lull here while I'm doing kind of some mindless digging, um, I always harped on this in my uh, my first let's plays, my first Minecraft let's plays. That is the ones that unfortunately I've lost that I appreciate feedback of all sorts. I am still very new to the whole Let's Play scene. Uh, I do this because I think it's fun. I do it because I enjoy playing games, and I, I'd like to think that I'm uh, relatively decent to watch, that I'm not too painful and I'm not too awful to listen to. But I always appreciate feedback, whether positive or negative. I just I appreciate constructive uh, feedback, constructive criticism. Um, I like to know what folks like, what they don't like, what I can change, etc., yada, yada. Uh, because, I don't know, honestly, I'd like to continue doing this. And if I'm going to con continue doing this, boy, if I could speak, uh, I would very much like to do it in a way that folks enjoy it. That was a weird change in the light level there. So I really do appreciate uh, any and all feedback. Um, I promise you that I, I, I listen to it, um, I read it, I hear it, I consider it, I don't just blow it off and um, think that you're being an asshole or something like that if you have something poor to say. I do really, truly appreciate uh, any feedback that anybody has to offer. Um, I think we'll need to eat a steak or so here. I'm getting kind of hungry. Whoops. Preferably not looking at the furnace, though, I guess. Is nine and three quarters enough to start healing me? Yes, it is. All right. That's what we were after. Um, how wide is my room? So one, two, three, four, five... So there's one, two, damn it. Boy, I can count. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, well, so we'll loink, do that, throw up a torch, start coming down this way. My Xbox just pinged because I'm also playing Grand Theft Auto V. Uh, of course, that came out just last week. 
Xbox is continuing to ping as friends go on and offline. Uh, but yeah, Grand Theft Auto V came out last week. Uh, I know clearly this is a Minecraft Let's Play, not a Grand Theft Auto Let's Play, but I just have to say it's pretty phenomenal. I am slowly progressing through the story as I have time. I am quite the fan so far. I actually wasn't expecting to get the game. I ended up getting it as a gift from my brother. Uh, much appreciated. Um, man, I should really count my progress here. I'll just do it five by five. There's one, two, three, four, five. Which means I just took out way too much. Which is alright. That's alright. Everything's easily fixable in Minecraft. Which is a good thing. There's one, there's two, three, four, and five. Huzzah. Okay. And of course, what I'm doing here is I'm just, uh, just mining down, hoping uh, hoping to find some resources that I can use. Uh, I'm really hoping for some iron. That would be pretty fantastic. Uh, get some buckets going. Uh, one, two, three. Get some buckets going. Uh, I need to make another pick. Um, and that sort of thing. Shed some light down here. So some iron would be great. Um, I have no idea where I'm going to run across it. Uh, I'd like some iron axes so I can go level the forest like I was talking about. Still very much nighttime. Oh, that cow just scared the absolute crap out of me. Why don't I do it like this so I can actually see roughly the skies? Kind of? Not really. Oh, it's alright. One, two, three. One, two, three. We'll make three picks this time so that I can actually stay down for a little longer, hopefully. Ready to go. Ready to work. Now, I used to have a pretty solid grasp of the mechanic of, th of this game. And what I mean by that is, um, you know, of course I can play it. Um, almost anybody can play Minecraft. But I, at one point, I really understood, like, oh, you know, monsters only spawn at, you know, certain light levels. Two, one, two, three, four, five. And that sort of thing. And that actually really helps, I think, to, to play the game... Ooh, hello, little cave... To, to really have an understanding of the game and, and to play the game as effectively as, as possible. Uh, Minecraft is actually a pretty complex game when you really get down to it. Uh, there's there's a lot to it. There's lots of aspects. I'm going to block this off just so I don't get destroyed from that direction. Iron! Yay! There's uh, there's lots of aspects to the game. Uh, time to go exploring in the scary darkness with no sound. There's lots of aspects to the game that, um, I mean, you need to understand... Oh, bugger. Um... You know, monsters spawn at, like I said, light level, you know, XYZ and below. Or, um, I think maybe I'll just block this off up here. Or, um, you know, maybe certain minerals, you know, spawn at levels XYZ and above or below or that sort of thing. And it, it's actually, I, I, like I said, I think it's actually pretty, um, pretty important to know that kind of stuff so that you can, that's not really what I meant to build, but that's okay. So that you can, well, I'm just talking in circles here, but so you can play the game as, as efficiently and effectively as possible. Um, even like knowing the pattern of the ore deposits, so that... I think, oh, it's just a bat. Phew, well, that scared the crap out of me. Knowing the pattern of ore deposits, so you know, you know, is it worth it to continue mining here, or have I really uh, mined everything that there is, or that sort of thing. I don't want to hit you, friend. Stay out of my pickaxes. Really? Okay. Oh, easy come, easy go, you know. Um, where I was going with that whole rambling conversation that I, I was doing a terribly, or a very poor job of explaining, is that I used to have a, a really solid grasp of this game. I, I was um, I was actually on the Minecraft wiki pretty frequently. Um, I, I knew a lot about the game. I would always kind of amaze my friends. We'd be playing, and they'd say, oh, you know, I don't think that this or this or that is possible. I'd say, oh, you know, it absolutely is because of, you know, this characteristic or this... Um, coding specification or that sort of thing, or you know, it, you know, it's absolutely possible because uh, you know here's why it's possible or that kind of thing. But since everything has changed, I just man, I don't know. I'm I'm not very familiar with this game anymore, and it kind of makes me sad because Minecraft really is such a phenomenal game. But I just I'm, I'm not used to it anymore. So it's that's why that's another good reason for me to start playing it again. Just kind of get used to the ropes. I, I suspect I'll have the Minecraft wiki open quite frequently, trying to understand some of the newer mechanics and crafting recipes and that sort of thing. 
I'm going to return to the surface here. Actually, I think it's about time to uh, stop this recording. If I'm paying attention correctly here, I think I've been recording for about 20 minutes or so. So we're going to go ahead and uh, give this a pause, uh, give the recording a stop, and we'll start again in, uh, in just a moment here. Thanks, everybody, for watching so far. And as always, I appreciate any questions, comments, concerns, uh, either positive or negative, and hope to see you next time. See ya.